What's up guys, Empire Break Studios here, back with part 7 of the Lego Hall video. Um, this is stuff for Solus, well some of it's for Solus, but, uh, so I'm gonna jump right into it. I just got back from my Lego store a little bit ago. Um, it is Bricks and Wheels in Kent, if you live in the, uh, uh, Washington State area, sorry, Washington State area, check them out. Great guy. Uh, hooked me up again. So let's jump into it. So these are some of the parts that I ordered there. The 1x3x2 or whatever. Dark gray slopes. And I have, a, I have a bunch more on the way. So this is a start to get those mountains going. So I'm really happy. Um, I also have the inverted slopes coming too of these. Like, I ordered, I think, 250 of each, and this is just some of them. So, like, 250 of these, and then, like, 250 of the inverted slopes. So, just waiting on those to come in. But this is a good start. And I did grab a few extra from the, uh, uh, the random table of, like, loose parts and stuff. So, I got a few more, a few extra besides that. So, there's that. Um, I also got the hookup on these tiles. Which is good because I always need more tiles, light gray, and even some dark gray. Like, I needed most of these for uh, the cutouts, uh, the border of the cutouts, so that'll come in handy, and that's mostly what I'm probably going to use these for. All the light gray stuff can be used for like floors and stuff like that. And I was like completely running out of dark gray, like tiles and pieces and stuff like that, so awesome. Um,. I picked up this little micro fighter. It was cheap. I mostly got it for the uh, TIE Pilot. And I really like, I mean, I'm not too big into micro fighters like this, but it's got some parts I could probably use, or I could customize it like I did with my TIE Interceptor and make a, uh, like a, uh, I don't know, just some type of fighter for it to like, for the figure to go in there or just break it down keep the figure and then use parts for something else i don't know it's cheap so everything's there so that's nice um oh so we'll jump into this i am a vip lego member and this was at the store and i actually thought this was really cool this is a uh a vip edition uh little lego store thing and it's really cool um, so I had to pick that up. I probably will put this in a future mock. Pick a brick. Oh, that's so cool. It's got the pick a brick wall and everything. So I'll probably put this in a future mock at some point. And to go with that, I ended up getting, uh, this guy. See, he was super cheap. Um, just another Lego store employee, which is really cool. So I do want to use these in some type of future mock. Um... At some point, so that's really cool. I really like those. I ended up, you guys always know that when I go to Bricks and Wheels, I have to get a bag of random stuff. Um, it's a loose table, so I throw whatever I can in there. A lot of this is filler, so bricks like this and stuff like that is filler. Um, I did find a lot of, or a decent amount of dark gray stuff, so I tried to throw as much dark gray stuff in here as possible, so like plates and, um, bricks and stuff like that see inverted slope whatever i could find see if i see those i want to throw those in there <coughs> so now i got to separate all this organize it at some point um also got i got a good deal on these wall pieces not gonna say how much but these are well i'd say the color ones are going to be used for filler um the dark gray ones i gotta pull the sticker off of that the dark gray ones I might use as like interior stuff or whatever. Still haven't decided, but I know a lot of this is good for uh, filler and that's what I'm probably gonna use behind some of the mountains because it comes in handy and you guys will never see it. So yeah, move all this to the side. One second, okay. I did end up picking up some sets as well. So I actually like some of these uh, a couple of these Geonosis sets. Um, I actually have that figure already, but 
I was always wondering where he came from, and now I know. <laughs> and it's always nice to have more Jedi, because I'm, uh, I'm gonna have a Jedi collection. And I think I already have this figure, but with the, uh, uh, what is it, the skirt piece? Or that could be a totally different Jedi. But, uh, yeah, I like, uh, I like these little Geonos uh, Geonosis sets, so I picked up a couple of them. <coughs> I got this one. I don't know what that's called. Hail, Fire, Droid, and Spider Droid. Yeah, yeah. So, I'll probably build these at some point. And I do like the figures. They'll go with my uh, my other battle droids. Or uh, I might save this for a future mock or break it down for parts. I haven't decided yet. As far as you guys know. Um, the other thing I got is I mostly got this for the figures. Like, I really don't need this speeder and I'm not going to build it. I could use it for parts, but uh, I really like the uh, General Grievous figure, so I'm really stoked about building that guy with all four of the lightsabers. Maybe like a little mock of like him versus uh, Obi Wan or Obi Wan and uh, Anakin or something. I don't know. <coughs> I'm really excited about the Mace Windu figure because that purple lightsaber. Oh man. I'm so glad to have the Mace Windu figure in my Jedi collection. So he's going to go with the rest of them. So I'm really happy about that. Um, this isn't too long of a video. That's pretty much all I got for now. Um, I would have shown my red roll of LEDs if they came in, but they still haven't come in. Amazon, I don't know what you're doing. It's probably because of all the snow that's been happening over here, but... I'm still waiting on those, so, but I have enough, um, I have enough stuff to get me going and get back on those mountains and start to get the front of them. Now that the backs are done, let's get onto the front. So I hope you guys like this video. I know it was like really short, but that's, that's pretty much all I got. I didn't pick up a whole lot, but I really like these VIP uh, this VIP, um, uh, Lego store, and then the, the figure, the other figure that goes with it, I know they're, like, pretty much the same, but I figured, why not have two employees, there's more than one employee at a Lego store, so, yeah, that should be really cool, um, other than that, I'm headed out, um, Solist, don't know if I'm doing an uh, update video this weekend. Probably not. I guess it depends how I feel by Sunday. I know I'm working this weekend, so I probably won't have time to do a lot of building. Um, so next weekend, hopefully the rest of these come in and the inverted slopes come in. And I'm able to pick up more parts. And by next weekend, you guys should have a really cool Solus video. And it should be a good one. Um, I do have a video coming out on Monday. Um, it's called Mini Mock Monday, so check it out. Uh, last Monday I did, um, Endor, and this Monday, I can't say. You guys will just have to see it. It's really cool. It's, it's a lot better than Endor, I'll say that. As far as, like, build-wise, like, it looks a lot nicer. So, until then, remember guys, keep on building.